I want to thank you all for coming down here today. I hope it's not too hot. You can always turn the thermostat down a couple thousand degrees if anyone gets uncomfortable. Mmm. Kale flavor, it's my favorite. As you all know, the team and I suffered a uh, big defeat this week with um, the overturn of Roe v. Wade. We went out there, we, we gave it our all. Uh, we had a fantastic offensive game, but ultimately the good guys and, uh, and Justice Roberts came in clutch. Played a better game. So let's, uh, let's take some questions. Uh, you, you there with the teeth. Satan, it seemed like you had it in the bag with Roe on lockdown for 50 years. What went wrong out there? Yeah, yeah, thank you, thank you for the question. Um, you know, we gotta look on the bright side here. We, we put up some incredible numbers. Over 60 million PBAs, that's preborn babies aborted for the late person. It's an absolute world record. Uh, yeah, I can't take all the credit though. This is a team sport and uh, we got an incredible team, you know. Got Planned Parenthood. Moloch, Nancy Pelosi, they all made this possible. It didn't go the way that we uh, wanted this time. But in the end, we still have a championship team of demons, devils, and Democrats out there. And you know, there's always, uh, there's always next season. Excuse me, the devil, uh, what are your plans for the health franchise going forward? Uh, excellent question. Uh, obviously, this is a rebuilding year for us. We're gonna, we're gonna build back better. And uh, we have some great up and coming prospects. We got Kamala Harris. Uh, you've heard her uh, demonic cackle. Of course, it's one of the best in the game. It scares even me sometimes. <laughs> you know. Uh, of course, we've got all the, the progressive Christians out there. Uh, we got the guy from Green Day. We got Pink now. And of course, the Republicans with the weak defensive game. So thanks, Mitch. Um, you know, they let us remain dominant, killing babies for over 50 years. And let's not forget, we still have we still have California and New York in, in in the bag, putting up incredible numbers in the child sacrifice department. Anything else you can tease for the fans out there? Well, uh, let's see. Well, while our abortion game will be down for a while, we've got some great stuff lined up. So we're gonna be rolling out another Amy Schumer comedy special. That's good. Um, we got an even flimsier paper straw debuting next year. And we're putting more extremely long, unskippable cutscenes in video games. You know, the ones with the sudden QT sequences where you gotta mash X or you instantly die. You have to watch the whole thing again. That's <laughs> classic. Uh, uh, so, you know, uh, don't count us out. Um, anyway, uh, I gotta make a, an appearance at a family-friendly drag show in Texas. No more questions, okay? This press conference is over. And, oh, and, and Beelzebub, uh, release the bees. Wait, what? Bees? You know, so many people helped us through the years. Margaret Sanger, Alyssa Milano, shout out to my homegirl, uh, Michelle Obama out there, thanks for the support. Let's see, Jen Hatmaker, uh, Rachel Hollis, uh, the absolute goat, Kermit Gosnell, uh, pretty much every Hollywood actor, uh, except for that, uh, that guy who played Frazier, uh, uh, Joe Biden's handlers, uh, all the Republican congressmen uh, who've gotten their mistresses pregnant, uh, and the ladies from my favorite television show of all time, The View. They do great work. Oh, and Steve, 